Hello everybody. In this video, we are going to see about the four strokes of the four stroke engine. So the four strokes are intaking stroke, compression stroke, power stroke, exhaust stroke. So the four strokes are intaking stroke, intake the fuel and air mixture, then compression stroke, compress the air and fuel, then power stroke that is the power power up due to the, the burning, the blasting of the uh, fuel and air mixture due to the spark. Then exhaust stroke the elimination of or removal of the fumes and carb carbon dioxide carbon monoxide and unburned gases so let's we see the what will happen inside the cylinder in the four stroke cycles so let's we remove this open this cylinder then this is the this is the head so this is the combustion chamber so this is the combustion chamber i'll remove this one so this one is intaking port and this one is exhaust uh, valve, intake valve, exhaust valve, intake valve, exhaust valve. This is a muffler and the carburetor here, the small carburetor is there. So the carburetor supply the fuel air mixture here through this intake valve. Then our exhaust valve, the burn gases are the removing from this or elimination or the, the uh, from here. So keep remember this position of the flywheel or crankshaft which is connected with the crankshaft keep remember this position so we have a mark here right then let's start the cycles so cycle one is intaking stroke right you see that when intaking the moving of the piston downside moving piston downside moving from top dead center to bottom dead center tdc to bdc so you see that the intaking valve is opening the intaking valve is opening when opening intaking valve the this space this space this space replaced by the fuel air mixture right then the air fuel air mixture coming through this opening and fill here so this is the bottom dead center of the piston so what you see that the half cycle of the crank crank half cycle completed one stroke piston moved from TDC to BDC. So then second cycle is compression. So next compression, the piston moving from bottom to dead center to top dead center. You see that? So then compressing the air. This amount of air is compressing with this small amount. So the reaches, the maximum reaches reach the the flywheel half cycle the second half cycle so one cycle completed the crankshaft so in this time both valves are closed then due to the due to the spark due to the spark the air fuel filled with here compressed at the maximum compression here at the time the burning due to the burning or the blasting fire blasting the power the power stroke will start so power stroke at the at this time you see that the both valves are closed closed piston moving tdc to bdc at this time so one cycle completed second half started the second half at the second half piston reaches the bottom center the bottom dead center bdc so then next is exhaust stroke then this one exhaust stroke at this time you see that the exhaust valve opening so compressing in this space filled with the burn gases and carbon dioxide carbon monoxide unburned gases are here that is compressing and moving from here this this way so through this it will exhausting here that is when the maximum exhaust stroke the piston reaches the top dead center you see that the crank or the flywheel cycle two cycles are completed so the in the four stroke engine four movement of the four strokes of the piston movement two cycle of the crank movement two rotational cycle of the crank movement completed then four strokes completed so this is the four stroke cycle of the single cylinder petrol four stroke engine clear so let's we see in next video. Thank you.